Greetings, this is Dr. Lyon. Really glad you've joined us. We're going to have another one of these chats where we talk about a different aspect of health and wellness, and today we're going to talk about headaches. Now, before I say anything, I want to let you know that I'm fully aware that there are a number of different types of headaches. Tension headaches, sinus headaches, cluster headaches, and there can be some very serious underlying causes to headaches. If you or someone you love is having headaches or experiencing headaches, especially ones that are different like you've never had before, it's so important that you get to a licensed healthcare provider and get checked. Having said that, I'd like to talk about my clinical experience and my thoughts on headaches and how this work can help you. Did you know that in my estimation, about 90% of all headaches have nothing to do with your head? Let's take that a step further and I'm going to say that 80% of most headaches that I've seen, that most headaches most chiropractors see, that most headaches that most family physicians see are probably related to stress. This is an important thing. So we tend to make some very basic and fundamental mistakes when we're trying to help ourselves or our family members or our patients with headaches. Let's talk about what some of those are, and if you're watching this yourself, think about some of the common mistakes that you might make, or that your family might make. And I also want to say, before I go into this list of the common things that I see us often do so wrong, is that you know, I understand this not only as a doctor who's worked with hundreds of patients with headaches, but also understand it as a patient, having sat across from different kinds of doctors, hoping that my headaches would go away. I used to have daily headaches daily and they would knock me out. Sometimes I'd go periods where they weren't daily but I'd get them and they'd last for three days. Obviously completely cut into how I could enjoy my life, how I could exercise, how I could be present with my family, the things that I could show up for. I mean look, we all know it's hard to enjoy your life when you're in pain all the time. And so we want to be sensitive to the fact that you, like I did, want to get out of pain. And we also want to understand that the most critical thing we can do is get to the underlying cause. Having said that, 80% of headaches are probably stress related and we make a lot of mistakes trying to get rid of the pain. What are some of those? The first one is we just mask the symptoms, right? So if you were a patient, right, or let's say you were a doctor and someone came into you with an arrow through their head and this was obviously causing a headache. Right? And so you might say to this person, well, would you like us to get rid of the pain or would you like us to take out the arrow from your head, fix the damage that's been done, and then help you? Obviously, 100% of the people, hopefully in their right mind, would say they want to get the arrow taken out of their head. So what do we do? We tend to do patch jobs. We get hooked on over-the-counter prescription medications to get rid of our pain. First, not a healthy solution because it damages your gut. If you're taking powerful pain relievers, it absolutely can trash your body and keep you hooked on medication and create what's known as rebound headaches. So then you try to get off the medication and they just come right back like a rebound. So it's really important to understand this isn't a sustainable lasting solution. Now we also might just ignore them. This is another common mistake. We just ignore them. We hope they'll go away. This kind of leads to the third mistake people make. They think it's normal that you have headaches. It's normal to have headaches three times a week. It's normal to have migraines. It's normal to have these things. I'm going to tell you from a health, wellness, and vitality perspective, it's not. Pain is always a message that you've got to stop, pay attention, and do something different. Really important to understand. One of the other mistakes we make is that we end up cutting back on life. You know, we cut back on the things that either give us health or give us joy or give us meaning because we want to avoid headaches or we'll do certain things to try to avoid headaches such as changing an exercise routine that may be exacerbating the problem. We also might get hooked on certain therapies like symptom-based chiropractic care or symptom-based massage therapy or symptom-based acupuncture. Now I have a great respect for all these traditions. Obviously I'm a chiropractor, I have a master's degree in acupuncture and I practice acupuncture. And a lot of times people can often get hooked on these things without ever getting lasting, truly lasting results. So it's important to understand there's different kinds of chiropractors, there's different kinds of acupuncturists, and 
you know, going back to get your crack and pop to get your headache to go away, when in fact you're the one that's been creating the headache all along, is probably not the best sustainable solution either. Now there's awesome news, totally awesome news, and that is that there are solutions. And these are solutions that not only can help you feel great, but can also dramatically improve the way you feel, how you show up in your life, how much energy you have, and how good you look. Absolutely. You know, we, the solutions that I personally use and I personally empower my patients to use are things that help us not only control and manage our stress, but actually convert that stress into something super positive in our lives so that we can be healthier than we ever thought we could and do more in our life than we ever thought was possible. Um, the solutions that I particularly offer specifically with network spinal analysis allow you to feel more flexible in your body. That means your spine's more flexible, your muscles are more flexible, your mind is more flexible, you're more adaptive to the stuff that life throws your way, you have greater mental focus, you have greater energy, so you can just be more and do more in your physical body. It's important to understand that stress dramatically affects our posture, dramatically. Most of the muscles that stabilize the spine are under the control of the parts of the brain that are also processing stress. The more stress we have, the more stress we haven't processed. And remember, there's three kinds of stress, physical, chemical, and emotional. All of these contribute to poor posture. Poor posture absolutely gets us looped into headaches and having greater pain sensitivities. No doubt about it, this is a scientific fact. So you can not only help with your stress, you can get a much better posture and look a ton better and feel great about yourself. Finally. We can be headache free. And not only can we be headache free, but we can get to the underlying cause, help you to heal the stress and the poor posture that's usually behind 80% of headaches, and get rid of any nervous system interference so that every cell in your body is functioning at a much higher level. And this is what we do. Look, stress goes into our nervous system and it creates a posture and tension loop that actually creates things like headaches, immune sensitivities, heightened pain levels, and a decreased ability to handle stress. And when I find the underlying causes to your stress through my very specific work of network spinal analysis, which is a wonderful, gentle, evidence-based tool that includes none of the snapping, cracking, or popping associated with traditional chiropractic, we can get at the underlying causes and really help you to heal the damage that's been done over a lifetime to stop recreating problems in the future and to experience an unbelievable quality of life where you can experience physical, mental, emotional, and even spiritual well-being to levels that you never thought were possible. And so, you know, your headaches in this case might just be the ticket to a great life. And like I always say, pain, it's a call to wake up. It's a call to pay attention. It's a call to do something different. I really wish you the best on your journey. And I also want to encourage you to go to our website www.networkwellnesscharlotte.com If you go to the testimonials page, there's some fantastic and inspiring testimonials from people, likely just like you, who've had headaches and who've completely healed them and turned them around here in my office. I wish you all the best. Again, if you're having headaches that you've never felt before, if you've had chronic headaches, get checked by someone. Have an awesome day. May you experience boundless energy, vitality, and wellness. Many blessings. Thank you. Dr. Lyon. Thank you.